Okay, this is a little a little presentation. This is not uh, is uh, 2022, and uh, I present a little bit uh, Jalisco. Uh, can you uh, switch to the next slide? Yeah. Yeah. Okay, this is Guadalajara. It's a state here in Mexico. How you can get Guadalajara city? Guadalajara is the capital of Jalisco, and the organization, uh, committee, uh, conference activities, date, social activities, fees, and sponsors. We have contact some people. Well, okay, you can skip to the next slide, please. Okay. Okay. Next. Okay. Okay. Um, you can get in Guadalajara by the airport uh, coming from directly from Europe to Mexico City and from Mexico City, um, where is the biggest uh, airport in Mexico. You can take a flight to Jalisco, that is uh, Jalisco Airport, that is the second uh, biggest air airport in Mexico. And uh, so this is the Jalisco state, and we are in near to the Pacific uh, Ocean. Okay, in Mexico has uh, about 112 million of people. In Jalisco, we are 7 million, uh, a little bit more than 7 million of, of people. And Jalisco is the second place in the top major cities for economic potential in North America. I, this is the, um, the, 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 the um, and some uh, economic uh, numbers. The per capita um, input is about uh, 71.5 billion of dollars. And the, the next, this is not very important. To the next uh, next slide, please, Alex. I, I see it is away from the sea. Uh, is it in the mountains? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Should, should be nice. It's not working for some reason. Wait a second. Okay, got it. Okay. Um, Welcome to Jalisco. This is a, this was a, a, a phrase that uh, was we use here in Jalisco. Is ranked uh, as this sixth place in the ten top in Latin America cities. And uh, is not we that say that it is the FDI magazine is ranked as the first place in the top uh, metropolitan regions in the Latin America uh, site uh, se selection magazine. is a very good place to invest. And we have, uh, as I said before, many of the main um, um, uh, industries uh, in electronic, uh, electric, and computer science established here since many years uh, here in Mexico, uh, here in, in Jalisco, and we. This is because uh, we have a very well uh, universities, private and public universities, and uh, was choice, uh, the, for instance, uh, two weeks ago, a company for cybersecurity comes to establish here in Guadalajara from state. And the work we will be doing for the next uh, 10 years will be specifically for cyber sec cybersecurity in the United States. Wow. And, and Many industries come here, and uh, even the actual pandemic situation are looking for uh, some um, some some base here in in, in Guadalajara. The next slide. 
is uh, Alexei. The, the place where I am in Moscow is strong in cybersecurity, so probably they would be interested in coming to you. Uh, yes, yes, and they are hiring people from all around the world. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Next. So, next, please. Okay, um, as I said before, uh, Jalisco uh, has many universities, uh, 12 world-class university, uh, very, very many, many high schools. Uh, we have 70, uh, 67 postgraduate programs, two major business schools, uh, three technological universities, uh, 12 technological institutes, and we have 598 joy, job training centers, uh, 58 technical schools, and uh, those are the, the, the some of the universities. We have many others, private and public. We are Simba staff. We are a public uh, research center, but. Uh, also, we have uh, private uh, research centers. For instance, we have a research center of Microsoft, and we have um, part of a continental research center here in Jalisco in the metropolitan area. So I think it's a, it's a, a good environment for uh, BICA 2002. Oh, yes. So the next slide, please. OK, um, those are some uh, numbers about uh, the um, companies and the relation that we have with uh, the companies, actual uh, companies, main companies, and not just here in Mexico, but uh, uh, world-class uh, companies. Okay, this, those are some numbers that you can read in more easily than me. Okay, next slide, please. Next slide, Alexei. Do you see? Okay, this is where we are placed in the country. As you say, uh, is the blue uh, region is Jalisco. We have many many neighbors and we our main neighbor is the pacific ocean uh, here are some uh, numbers in that uh, say the distance to the cap different capitals uh, uh, around the, the mexico and the ways that we have to to go from guadalajara from jalisco to many other places so the connection are very, very good here in, 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 in Jalisco, in Guadalajara. Okay, next slide, next slide, please, Alexei. Okay, we have two international airports, uh, one here in, in Guadalajara, and the, the second one is in Puerto Vallarta. Puerto Vallarta is rather a touristic uh, city, a very beautiful um, seas, and you can take the sun and you can you have a very, very good spare time. Okay, and some uh, connection with the different uh, airports in, in, in the world, uh, mainly in United States. So next slide, please. Okay, Jalisco is innovation. Okay, we have many, as I said, many um, companies, international companies that are um, established here in Guadalajara because the, the kind of people we are here in Guadalajara, we are very enthusiastic and we try to um, to have some um, scholarity, good scholarity, good education, uh, and we uh, are 
the, the, the main uh, people in those companies are from here, from Jalisco. Uh, so I think that uh, those companies say something about uh, the, the people here in, in Jalisco. So it's, it's a good, it's a good uh, information that I want to, to share with you. Next slide, please. Okay, and we have more than 6,000 hotel rooms. We have many touristic developments. We have many areas that uh, we can share with people uh, like you. And uh, we, are, we have many places to, to develop events like uh, Baika and uh, we, we ought to choose one of those places to, to, to buy in 2022. So the next slide, is, please, Alexei. Uh, this this uh, uh, information is more for entrepreneur people. And I, we can read a little bit, but uh, we, I prefer to skip to the next slide, please, Alexei. Okay, this the institution that will host uh, BICA, our Simba staff, Guadalajara University, and the Autonomous uh, University of Guadalajara. Those are um, three of the main um, institutions and uh, education institutions uh, here in Jalisco. The two first are public institution and the third one is uh, a private institution. Which, which one of them would be the main host? Uh, Star. Okay. Next. Okay. Next, please. Okay, this is... Uh, our laboratory is not um, is not uh, in Simvestab only. Now is uh, is in different states and uh, in Mexico City, here in Jalisco, in Sinaloa, uh, and um, in Aguascalientes, and here in in Jalisco. We are uh, a group that uh, mainly we are um, education in computer science, but also we have collaborators from uh, cognitive science and the biologic uh, area. And we work very, um, very well and very close with them. Uh, also, we have people from um, uh, philosophy, uh, from architecture, uh, and many, many areas are uh, showing some interest in our work. Okay, next slide, please. These, those are some of uh, students, PhD students uh, in the NIC lab. And uh, some of them are not uh, more here in, in, as students and rather are working in private companies here in, and mainly in the States, in the United States, in, for different companies, Intel, Oracle, Microsoft, and many others companies. Okay, uh, in, this, um, in this event, we, I will be working with Jonathan Rosales from um, Autonomous University of Jalisco and Antonio Cervantes, who works in Guadalajara University, and Francisco Robles, uh, who works also in Guadalajara University. Next slide, please. Uh, okay, this is uh, some of my um, information, personal information. I work here in Simba staff since 1997. Uh, and I um, work, uh, my previous work work uh, was in distributed system, 
but uh, my interest always uh, was on artificial intelligence, and more exactly in distributed artificial intelligence. And in the last 12 years, I have um, been working on Huayoyotl, that is uh, a cognitive architecture um, based mainly in neuroscientific uh, evidence. Uh, so this is this is me. Okay, next, please. This is Antonio Cervantes, who works uh, now in Guadalajara University, and he was one of my uh, students, but now he works as a, an independent researcher, and uh, he uh, presents uh, um, his work different times in Baika and different other conferences. Next slide, please. And this is Jonathan Rosales, who uh, currently is working in Autonomous Guadalajara University. And together with Francisco um, Robles, who works also in Guadalajara University, but he has um, a PhD in neuroscience. Uh, we for will be organizing um, BICA, uh, 2022. Okay, next slide. Okay, and next, 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 next. Okay, the, in the conference, we are considering plenary talks, paper presentation, poster session, and if uh, we are able to, 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 to be here in Mexico, we will have some social events. Next, please. Um, okay, uh, the social events we consider we are considering uh, a reception event, a conference uh, dinner, and an optional tours here in Guadalajara and uh, Tequila. And uh, this is not just the name of. Uh, alcoholic beverage, but is also the name of a town here in Jalisco. And uh, as it's, it's a very nice place uh, to see the process of tequila. We have also Huachimontones that is the is, um, pre-Hispanic place where we have some pyramids, wow. not, uh, not uh, um, rectangular pyramids, but rather circular pyramids. I would like and to see pyramids, yeah. We have also an option, as an option, Chapala, Chapala Lake, that is the biggest uh, uh, lake here in Mexico. We have some uh, small island in, in the center of the lake, and we can see more options uh, for optional tours that will take about a, a half a day if we have the opportunity to be here in, 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 in Guadalajara. The next slide, please. Okay, and this, the, the, those are some uh, pictures about uh, our city and uh, here in Guadalajara. Next slide, please. This is the uh, Chapala Lake. Uh, this is this is as I said, is the biggest lake here in Mexico. We drink water from Guadalajara, from Chapala Lake. Okay, next slide, please. In the in the center, we have an island where we can eat uh, some food. Okay, this is tequila, uh, Jalisco. This is the cactus from um, this the from the, the, from from tequila. We make tequila from a cactus. Hmm. Okay, we take about 50 minutes from Guadalajara, and a very very nice uh, hacienda. I don't know if you understand hacienda, big uh, land 
where we grow these uh, cactus. Uh, next slide, please. And those are uh, the um, pyramids in, here in, in, in Jalisco. There's uh, circular pyramids, nor uh, rectangular, but it has a very, very interesting history. And it is, uh, is another place to, to, to visit. Obviously, we have uh, Tenochtitlan uh, in the, in the uh, Mexico City, Teotihuacan in the state of Mexico, and all the pyramids that we have in the south of Mexico, in Yucatan. And, uh, it's supposed that uh, all those uh, cultures uh, start his travel from here, from the north of Mexico, east, uh, rather, east of Mexico, and go through the south of Mexico, uh, founding different uh, cultures uh, around Mexico. Okay, next slide, please. Okay, dates. Uh, I will um, talk with Alexei mm -hmm. to, to see, to fix more precisely uh, the dates uh, for the conference and the events that we have. And I think uh, this is the end of this presentation. Uh, if you have some uh, comments or if you have some uh, um, something to say for the organization, it will be uh, very welcome. Uh, I am happy. Uh, and regarding the dates, I think what we have now could be an optimal date. I don't know. Uh, maybe it's the end of September or something like that. But we, we should uh, we should investigate uh, possible coincidence with religious holidays, with other conferences, with uh, all possible events. Like for example, uh, when the semester starts, all people teaching start working hard, even before that. Uh, in summer, they go on vacation. Uh, in at the end of uh, the fall, they go to other conferences. And actually, whatever date you take, it is always busy for some reasons. But yeah, uh, yeah, we need to investigate which dates. But actually, uh, this is your job now. You and David. And uh -huh. uh, what I can do is uh, use my connections with the publishers to provide go good publication venues with indexing and scopus. Uh, oh, instead, really? you you will be able to edit the volume, right? Okay. And okay, therefore, yeah. um, you would you and David would need to establish uh, easy chair and collect papers and process submissions. Perfect, perfect. Great. But I, Sounds good. I, th I think uh, we need uh, to talk a little bit more to to fix uh, everything that we ought to fix. Yeah, absolutely. Okay. After the conference, we shall talk. Okay. Uh, by the way, I, I will be busy with other events during this week, like. IVA, uh, I IVA, which is actually hosting our biker workshop, <laughs> as you could notice. And I encourage everybody to uh, take a look because it seems like they sent us the links to attend uh, virtually their event. And it's also a remarkable conference worth your attention. Yeah, so maybe next week we, uh, we should communicate. And yeah, yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. And we, we need to uh, get David involved in this process. And I am not sure if Rosario is here, probably not, but uh, he is also one of the officers of uh, Biker Society. And that's uh, that makes currently the three of us, uh, myself, Rosario and David Kelly. Uh, his plan was to expand the board of directors beyond the three up to seven. And I have no idea what is going to happen. Uh, most likely I will resign even as the director of 
uh, by Cassati. I I was the president. Uh, now I am one of the three directors, and uh, I guess I will resign from this position as well. Uh, still didn't decide finally, but uh, but we need to talk uh, all together, and uh, yeah, as you say, fix all those things because yeah. we need to start working. Uh, we need to start working on this event right now. Okay, yeah, great. Yeah. Okay, thank you, and thank you for considering uh, Mexico to be uh, hosting Baika 2022. I am not just considering. I think uh, we have an agreement now. Okay, okay, okay. <laughs> thank you. Thank you. Thank you very much.